Yo, guys, the Steelers played phenomenal football. Like, honestly, I could say it's flawless. But Nosberger, perfect quarterback rating. Through five touchdowns, through 328 yards, I believe. Something like that. So, yeah, he, he didn't play in the fourth quarter, really. They took him out and put Joshua Dobbs in. Good move, good move, because we were already up 52 to 14. Who cares about the fucking Panthers? <laughs> but the Panther fans are probably complain about a few calls. But to be honest, they shouldn't because they got their asses beat. It wouldn't have really mattered. They probably still would have lost. If, it, if they lost by like three, I'd be like, okay, you guys can complain about these few little calls, but you lost 52 to 21. Okay, technically they lost 52 to 14 because last touchdown was garbage time. And plus, Artie Burns just being Artie Burns, causing a P.I. call. So, yeah, sorry Panthers fans. I'm still going to consider it 52-14, sorry. But, yeah, it was 52-21. They just put a little skirt on the final score. But, who cares? We still won. But, J Jalen Samuels got his first NFL touchdown. Shout out to him. My dad's an NC State fan. He loves him to death. He was happy he scored. And James Connors, 100 yards per game. Like, he's at, he had 100 yards four games in a row rushing. And that streak came to an end, which doesn't bother me. I mean, it's a really short week, and plus he, he had concussion protocol, and I've gotten in arguments with my friends over it, and I don't even think they really even watched the game. Because Thomas Davis... Well, I don't even want to really talk about it. But yeah, there's a college football game going on right now. Sorry about that, guys. I <laughs> probably should have got this out as early as possible. And so, yeah, um, James Conner did end up getting hurt. but he, he was just out for the fourth quarter. I mean, he did get hurt going to the 10th then came back out and played for a few plays. Then went, then went back into the locker room. So... I guess my friends did not see that. They must have thought that he just wasn't... They just didn't want to play him. But, yeah. I mean, I wouldn't want to play him either because it's... Short Thursday, we were beating them by, like, 40 points. So, what's the point of... Well, 38. We were beating them by 38. But still, point still stands. Um, let's talk about Antonio Brown. Got a speeding ticket to 140, but let's just admit he does this every fucking year. Um, so yeah, he, he started, yeah, he did pretty good last night. He, he had 100 yards, but I guess he got like two catches for negative yards, which put it back to like 96 yards. So... About that, he could have had another hundred-yard game, but he did score a 40, 53 yard touchdown. Fifty-three yard touchdown, not four hundred fifty-three, but you know what I mean. So, and then people want to argue, saying, "Oh, that was pass interference." Actually, no, it isn't, because if you look, they were having an arm. They were basically arm fighting, which basically would have offset. So basically, Panthers fans are reacting over nothing, and plus, Dante Jackson slipped anyway. You could see in the replay. It's clear as fucking day. Like, Panther fans need to stop whining. Like, we've owned them for the past. We, they've only beat us once, and that was in 1996 when they just came in the fucking league. So if I was Panther fans, I would not even be talking anymore. And the thing is, I used to like the Panthers because, you know, Steelers and Panthers used to be all friends and all that. We're friends. But Panthers fans, ever since I moved to North Carolina, they've been assholes. So, sorry. I'm not going to be a fan of a team that's asshole to my favorite team. So, there you go. So yeah, that's pretty much how it goes nowadays. I mean, Panther fans are, what can you say? They're just very annoying. 
But, I mean, shout out to the Panthers, though. They did, they did what they had to do. I'm just kidding. They didn't do shit. But, Ron Rivera is a fucking idiot. Cam Newton was sitting there getting killed in, in the backfield. He's been hit at least, like, fucking ten times. And this motherfucker keeps him in the game down by, like, 38 points. Like, really? No. Mm -mm. You don't fucking do that shit to someone. Like, seriously, I don't give a fuck if you're down 50 points and you want to sit there and just put him back in the game. Like, no. If this man is getting... I mean, if he wasn't getting sacked or anything, that's one thing. Or anything like that. But it was actually his offensive line's fault anyway. Their offensive line is garbage. And Cam Newton was sitting there getting killed. Like, I have full respect for Cam Newton, okay? I respect him. Ron Rivera did something very stupid that you should never fucking do, which is put your franchise quarterback in jeopardy. Like, that he just did. And if he would have got hurt, that would have been on Ron Rivera. And me personally, I would fucking fire him after that game. I don't give a fuck if they're 6-3 and three or not. That's just something you should never fucking do. That's just me. Um, so yeah. Not much really happened for the Panthers. Um, and, oh, yeah, I forgot. That Juju Smith-Schuster touchdown. First play, 75 yards. It's a Steelers record. That's the longest touchdown on the first play the Steelers ever had. What can you say? We the best. And then there's pay and then there's Steelers fans that are like, oh, we want the Patriots. Like, slow down there. <laughs> slow down. We <laughs> We beat the Panthers by that many points. But we gotta slow down there first. Okay. We gotta face the Jaguars. I mean, we gotta worry about the Jaguars first. I mean, remember last time? Remember last time we were worried about the fucking Patriots? In the fucking playoffs, we fucking lost to the Jaguars. Like, we can't sit here and do this every fucking year. We gotta worry game by game. We can't just sit here and, like, think a game ahead. I mean, the Jaguars might be extremely fucking garbage this year, but who cares? We still gotta fight. We still gotta fucking play our best against them. But. Anyway, guys, I'm out, alright? It was great talking football, I'm out. Peace.